How to buy Ethereum Max or Emax on different exchanges. Decentralized exchanges are the only places to buy specific cryptocurrencies like Ethereum Max, which can only be acquired using another cryptocurrency. Therefore, to purchase Ethereum Max, you will first need to acquire Ethereum or ETH, which can then be used to obtain Ethereum Max. In 2021, the market for cryptocurrencies had developed tremendously, which has led to the launch of a significant number of brand new crypto coins on an almost continuous basis. The Emax token is one of the cryptocurrencies that has attracted much interest recently. Emax is a long-term project with an audacious vision, a strategic roadmap, and a unified community to reach ambitious objectives that few people have ever dreamed of. Although Emax has been listed on several cryptocurrency exchanges, it is impossible to buy it directly with fiat currency, unlike most important cryptocurrencies. However, it is still possible to purchase this coin without much difficulty if you first purchase Ethereum from any exchange that deals in fiat to cryptocurrency transactions and then move your Ethereum to an exchange that sells in transactions involving this coin. Just a quick reminder, our channel has a weekly giveaway of $100 worth of a cryptocurrency of your choice. All you have to do to win is watch this video, drop us a comment below this video saying you subscribed, and let us know which cryptocurrency you would choose and why. The winners will be contacted directly. Good luck! Step 1. Choose any fiat to crypto exchange to register. First, you will have to acquire Ethereum. Then, you'll have to choose a better crypto exchange based on your likeness and the benefits you want. For example, you can try Coinbase, Binance, TrustWallet, Bitfinex, or Bitforex. Of course, all exchanges have their unique regulations regarding fees and other features. But, before we move ahead, it is strongly suggested that you experiment with all of them to determine which one is most suitable for you. Apart from accepting fiat deposits, Coinbase is one of the major crypto exchanges that do so. Step 2. Buy ETH with fiat money. After you have completed the Know Your Customer steps, you will be prompted to add a payment method. At this point, you will be given the option to either supply a credit or debit card or to make a transfer from your bank account. When you pay with a card, you will be subject to higher costs. However, you will be able to complete your transaction immediately. Compared to a bank transfer, which will be more cost-effective but take longer to complete. Now, click the Trade button in the upper left corner of the screen. Choose Ethereum from the drop-down menu and complete your transaction. Congratulations! You've just completed your very first purchase of cryptocurrency. Step 3. Transfer your ETH to an altcoin exchange. However, our work is not quite over. Because Emax is an alternative cryptocurrency, we need to send our ETH to an exchange where Emax may be exchanged. For this example, we will utilize Bitforex as our exchange. Bitforex is a widely used platform for trading alternative cryptocurrencies. In addition, the platform supports a considerable variety of pairings for trading altcoins. In our opinion, there are a lot of reason to prefer Bitforex. This exchange is one of six currently registered in the Republic of Seychelles. Bitforex shared the news with its customers in an email sent out on October 23, 2019, stating that it now has more than 3 million customers. After going through a procedure similar to what we've done in the past with Coinbase, you will be prompted to set up two-factor authentication, or 2FA. You should do so, since it provides an additional layer of protection to your account. Step 4. Deposit ETH to Exchange Depending on the exchange's requirements, you could need to go through another KYC procedure, which might take anywhere from 30 minutes to a few days at most. If this is your first time making a deposit in cryptocurrency, the screen you see may seem somewhat intimidating. However, you shouldn't be concerned since the process is far easier than completing a bank transfer. In the box on the right, you will see a string of random digits followed by the words ETH address. This is the one-of-a-kind public address of your Ether ETH wallet on Bitforex. The only way to receive Ether is to provide this address to the person sending you payments. Click the Copy Address button or right-click on the entire address and choose the Copy option to save this address to your clipboard. We will need it later when we move the ETH that we purchased from Coinbase in the past and transfer it to this wallet. Now, go back to Coinbase. Open your portfolio, choose Ethereum from the list of your assets, and click the Send button on the right side of the screen. 
paste the wallet address from your clipboard into the recipient box. Always double check that the wallet addresses match before sending. Certain computer viruses have been known to modify the contents of your clipboard into a different wallet address, thereby transferring cash to a different individual. Bitforex will get your money as soon as you click send and follow the instructions in the confirmation email. You may now return to Bitforex and check your exchange wallets. If your deposit hasn't been shown there, don't be concerned. It may take a few minutes for your money to arrive. At the same time, the transaction is being validated in the blockchain network. Due to the Ethereum network's high usage, it may take longer during peak periods. Bitforex will send you a confirmation email once your ETH has been received. Finally, you're ready to buy Emacs. If you made it this far and you haven't already, now is a great time to like, subscribe, and win $100 in cryptos. Step 5. Trade your Emacs. Return to the Bitforex homepage, then click the Exchange tab. Boom! What a sight to see! The continually moving numbers could fright you, but try to remain calm and give us some time to get our brains around this. A search bar is located in the right column. As we are trading ETH to altcoin pairs, make sure that ETH is chosen in the search bar. You should see Emacs slash ETH when you click on it and key in Emacs. After selecting that pair, you should see a price chart for Emacs slash ETH in the center of the page. Below is a box with a green button that reads Buy Emacs. Inside the box, choose the market option here since that is the form of purchasing order that is the easiest to understand. Next, you can either manually enter your desired amount or use the percentage buttons to choose what share of your deposit you would want to devote to the purchase of items. Finally, click the Buy Emacs button after ensuring everything is correct. Voila! You have taken the plunge and purchased Emacs. Final step. Store Emacs securely in hardware wallets. A hardware wallet is undeniably the superior choice to cold wallets in this situation. They are often gadgets that may be powered by USB and keep the essential details of your wallet more secure. They are created with military-grade security. Their producers continually update and maintain their firmware, which is very secure. The most well-known choices in this category are the Ledger Nano S and the Ledger Nano X. The prices of these wallets range from around $50 to $100, and their prices are determined by their functionality. Purchasing one of these wallets should be considered a worthwhile investment if you keep your possessions. If you want to learn the best wallets to keep your crypto safe, watch the video I post on the screen next. It will help you massively in understanding and choosing a wallet successfully. Do not miss this crucial video. See you over there!